Welcome to the next part of the loan from Alan Walker. In this part, we are talking about the left hand. And this is something in the easy version which can be played the whole song through because we have the whole, um, just the four easy chords. And what we're doing is to play a version of these chords. So this is a version of the G minor chord. And we play the G, the D, and again the G, like this. G with the pinky, pointer D, thumb G. So, and for example, in the verse, we play the notes one after the other. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Okay? For example, later we play them together. Okay, but first of all, let's play them together. Um, after the one after the other. G, D, G, two, four. This is something you should practice and repeat now. Yeah. G, D, G, O, yeah. G, D, G, with this timing. G, D, G. Okay, the next is E flat, B flat, E flat, P but also pinky, pointer, thumb, bum, 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 three, four, three, four, three, four. Okay, repeat this again and again. If you want, you can pause the video. This is always great if you want to practice something. Okay, then we have the next chord. This is the B chord. So we have, well, this is the B flat chord. We have B flat, we have F, and we have B. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Three, four. B flat, F, B flat, four. Bum, bum, bum. Three, four. Okay, great, and if you repeat this again and again, we go to the next chord, and this is the F chord. Now we have F, C, F, Jum, Jum, F, C, F, okay? Okay, these are versions of the chords. What do I mean with versions? For example, for G minor, it's this, but the origin G minor is like this. So, I skipped the B flat, and I doubled the G. It sounds cleaner, right? It's not like uh, these notes are too close together. So I decided to play this version. But more with the chords later. What you should do in the next step is to practice is like um to play practice them like this. One, two, three, four. G minor, two, three, four. E flat, B flat, and F. Okay, but start slower. G minor, two, three, four. E flat, three, four. B flat, three, four, and F, and three, four. Also, you can leave you don't have to leave them the whole time. For example, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, you leave already one, two. When I say three, you can leave it and to be in time for the next chord, to prepare the next chord. This is very important. To leave this chord early enough to be in time here and also here go ahead early enough so that you made it here till in time don't stress like this uh, uh, here so that you don't make anything okay and of course if you can play it like this you're nearly a pro this is something yeah, you can practice, of course. You can um, repeat, repeat again and again, and you will be able to play it like this. Okay, but first, let, let's let um, yeah, take your time and play it. One, two, three, prepare. One, two, three, prepare the next chord. Two, three, prepare, and F, T, 
two, three. Okay, great. If you make this, if you make this, we can go on with this step. One, bum, bum, three, prepare. One, two, three, three, prepare. One, bum, bum, three, prepare next chord. Three, prepare. And later we can do it faster. Four, three, four. Yeah. Okay, great. This is the left hand. Um, if you do have a pedal, you can press the pedal at the beginning of each chord. Now, now leave it and press it immediately. Again, now leave it and press it immediately. Now. When I say now, my foot goes up and immediately down again. One. Okay, so this is the left hand, but don't forget uh, when you add the pedal, it's more complicated for your brain, you have to practice it. This is very normal for each piano player in the world. Okay, so if you made the left hand, we can bring both hands together and this is something we're going to do in the next part. So see you there.